it has come the money <laughs> Welcome back to this week's video. Um, it's been a long week. <laughs> uh, two exams, a lot of revision, and not a huge amount of time for anything else. And the the time that I've had that isn't exams or revision, I've spent playing tennis, spending time with my flatmates before they go away for the summer, um, and attempting to sleep. So, apologies for the slightly more rustic video this week. Um, not many funky transitions or uh, footage of me in the library or anything like that. Um, it's just clip into clip into clip. But if you appreciate me working to get this video out during my exam period, please give it a big thumbs up. Uh, feel free to ask any questions in the comments. I'll try and get back to you. And please subscribe if you haven't already, because <laughs> it will uh, it, it will give me some validation for the work this week. Uh, very superficial, I know, but it would be appreciated. So here we go. Yesterday we had Oreo Regatta. Um, it was really good fun and a bit chaotic, but uh, yeah, no... Uh, we were um, in a mixed boat, uh, all first years from Worcester, so it was really nice. Um, we've all started learning rowing this year, so it's, it was really good fun. Um, we didn't win, unfortunately, so we didn't progress to the next rounds, but it was great. I then came home, tried to motivate myself to do revision after having uh, Friday and Saturday quite chilled out because my friend was here. Um... But it didn't happen. It's now Sunday and I've been in the library for two hours already this morning and I'm about to go again for the rest of the afternoon. I've just had a quick lunch. So, yeah, I'm, I've am i managed to start on the French books now. I'm on La Châtelaine de Vergy, which is the medieval narrative poem, I guess we can call it. Um, and, yeah, it's going well. So, off I go. It has come the morning of my first exam, and I'm feeling okay. I'm not too stressed. Um, I have been dealing with some rowing stuff this morning, <laughs> which might have helped take my mind off things. Um, I didn't film yesterday uh, because I just didn't find the time, I guess. Um, but I spent the day revising in the morning. We had a relatively long committee meeting at lunchtime for rowing. Uh, sort of our first official one, I think. And then I spent the afternoon revising as well and got to bed relatively early just so that I could have some proper sleep. Um, yesterday was, I hate to admit it, the first time I properly revised for um, this exam this exam this morning. Uh, it's French grammar and, as I said last week, I'm not as worried about the grammar exam, so I've been really focusing on the literature but I did think that it would be appropriate to uh, do some revision yesterday for this. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to get changed because we have to wear our gowns and stuff. And uh, head off with uh, a couple of other people who are doing it from Worcester. And we're going to walk over to the exam schools together. Off I go. Um, exam number one finished. It was all right. I mean, I've done a mock of that one twice, and both times I've thought, oh, I haven't done very well, and both times I've done very well, so <laughs> impossible to tell. I thought there was a mistake with the paper, if I'm completely honest, um, and what you're meant to do there is just write what you think the mistake is and then answer the question as you think it should be. Um, so I did that. Uh, <laughs> probably won't make myself very popular, but there we go. Um... I also managed to leave before the last half an hour um, because I finished. So I finished, I checked through um, and you can leave the exam schools 
up to half an hour before the end of your exam, um, which I did because it means I can have a more relaxed lunch and I have more time to do revision for tomorrow's exam uh, this afternoon. So, yeah, um, I'll tell you about carnations. Um, so traditionally, you are meant to wear a white one for your first exam of the year and a red one for the last exam of the year. And for all the ones in between, you wear a pink one, which is quite nice. And your college parents traditionally get them for you. Um, I only have two exams that are in person this year. So I don't know if I wear a pink one or a red one tomorrow. Um, I'll figure it out. Um, but yeah, exam one, tick, done. Uh, exam two, here we go. Exam two coming up, French grammar and translation. Um feeling relatively okay about it, I'm not too stressed, and uh, again, I haven't done much revision, which is definitely not recommended, I'd feel much more comfortable if I'd had done a lot more, uh, but I just haven't really had time. Um, I am banking on the matching pink hair and carnation to just, to just get me through, you know? Um, so yeah, I will see you later. Exam done, lunch eaten, and uh, revision time. Oh, what a surprise. Um, yeah, I actually preferred this one, the Spanish grammar and translation to the French one. Um, I managed to feel finish early again. I finished in about an hour and a half, uh, went to the toilet, relaxed a little bit, and then checked over a couple of times. And then at that point, I thought, well, I'm not going to find any other mistakes, so goodbye. And uh, I got back early, which was nice. Um, I know some people like to look over their papers over and over and over and over again. But if I do that, I just get stressed that I can't find any mistakes or I find too many mistakes. And in reality, what I'd written in the first place was right. So I like to leave. Um, I'll probably play some tennis later. And then I have my first captain's meeting this afternoon. No, sorry, this evening. Um, so it's where every single uh, rowing club, college rowing club, sends one or two captains to the captain's meeting to talk about various things. Apparently it's very boring, but at least um, at least this week it's in Worcester. It's at the Sultan Nazrin Shah Centre, so I'm not looking forward to it, but it will be all right. And then later on we are playing Dungeons & Dragons in the Cottage Gang, which we haven't done for ages because we've had loads of exams. Um, so it'll be really nice. Um, but anyway, for now, back to the library to do some La Châtelaine de Vergy revision, hopefully finish off those essay plans so that I can start on Les Liaisons Dangereuses tomorrow. See you later. I've got to the end of editing now. Um, this is the conclusion. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions, as I said, uh, about exams or anything, uh, stick it in the comment section below, and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Um... Next week, we will have something probably quite similar, um, just because it's a lot easier than planning a whole video, and it'll all be done, and I'll be on my way home. So, yeah, my first year of uni nearly finished. Just two more exams, and then there we go. So, if you want to see that, uh, stay tuned.